Hey ladies and gentlemen, today I'll be making some sweet Hawaiian chicken teriyaki. Uh, that's my own recipe and first you start off with some chicken breasts, um, skinless and I just picked it up right now, it's fresh off the block. Um, so I get pretty much one breast for each person, so I'm making enough for seven. The first thing you want to do, lay them all out, get a fork and poke some holes, several holes throughout the chicken. And I'm going to be doing that for the rest of these. I'm going to them. So, place your chicken. You could do this in a plastic bag. I like to do it in a bowl. Saves space and effort. So, pretty much put them all in here and lather with your favorite teriyaki marinade. Try to get all of the chicken. So good. Last piece, okay. Looks good. Alright, so that's marinating. You're going to take this, put it in the fridge for about 30 minutes, and then you're going to get started cutting up your vegetables. So you're going to use the basic peppers, go cut them into about a inch each um, pieces and then get a half of uh, red onion and cut it into rings so I'll be back when these are chopped alright got the onions chopped up and the peppers chopped up so line in the bottom of the pan like this and uh, sit the chicken out the fridge see how it looks mm. alright so we got our marinated chicken Looks amazing. Uh, you're going to have to drain the sauce, so be right back after I do that. I drained the chicken and it's time to put it on top of the peppers and onions. So. Pretty simple. Alright, so I've got my chicken layer and I've kept some peppers ready to top the chicken with, so put those bad boys on there. Got tired, got tired of my mom's cooking. It's gonna be the uh, same old meatloaf tonight, so I thought I'd mix it up and actually not have to make the family go through a horrible meal every Sunday. So, this one should be pretty good, thanks to me. Alright, so the peppers are on top of the chicken, and now I'm going to get pineapple slices and just go to mom. So, this is ready to go. We're gonna be sticking this in there for. 45 minutes and we'll be back with the finished product. Alright, so we'll be cooking it at 400 degrees for about 45 minutes. For best results, you might want to get one of these meat thermometers and have your chicken about 170 to 75 degrees internal temperature and we'll be back with the finished product. Time to serve up. Looks pretty good. Alright. What I like to do, get your favorite rice. Usually white rice works good. I got some teriyaki rice to go with the chicken. Cheese added, pineapples on top. Going to serve up some. So that's done. A little drizzle of uh, some sweet teriyaki sauce. Mm. And enjoy.